Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Today we're going to do an unboxing and a review of the Elf May Toys Workshop from Lee Max. And I found this toy in uh, well, not toy, decoration <laughs> in Sears this year. And I promised myself that this would be the last piece I'll buy for my uh, I'll, I'll buy for my Christmas village. Okay. Uh, let's look at this thing right here. Uh, it has music. It says on here. It has music, animation, and it has adapter. Okay, as we open the box up, we have uh, the normal instruction menu, like all the Laymax toys decoration <laughs> have right here. Okay, and then we have the unit itself. Let's take this out. This is the back of the building. Let's turn this thing up. Voila. There we go. And it also has a little bit of the uh, accessories in here. The little blue bag. Okay. It's kind of like a sign. You see? Elf made toys. And I have a little. Basket, kind of like a gift basket. Isn't that cute? And then has a flag. It says toys. And let's see the box. I believe the toys would go. The toy flag would go here on top of the castle. Okay, from the last video, we we'll put the little flag on on top of the tower here in the workshop. Okay, and now we're gonna put this um, Elf Make Toys sign on the side over here. Okay, let's turn it around. Let's put it right here. You see this right here. Okay, like that. And then this little uh, gift basket. This is very really cute. And then we're gonna put it on the hook. Probably wonder what this is. I believe this is the, the power. You can turn it on and off with all the lights and stuff. We'll get to that later, okay? All right, let's take a closer look at this workshop. Okay. So from the bottom, we have looks like it's gonna be animated here with these little elves right here. Okay. snow okay I think this turn turns right here so the all the stuff the stuffing goes in the door and then goes out from here this is wood and the elf will stay put and from the bottom there's the snow on the bottom and the little teddy bear over here laying against the gift boxes on the bottom it's really cool and on the right side we have elf made gift bag right here oh look at that isn't that cute and there's a little elephant and the drum And then it's the main entrance right here. It says open. And there's a little elf saying hi to you. Well, look at that. I mean, the, the facial detail of the elf could be a little better. <laughs> yeah. And on top, there's a little bell. It's attached to something. I think this will light up too. Oh, this is not a bell. Maybe it's a, it's a light. A little light. Okay. And this is kind of like a vacuum tunnel, I think. You can all the toys will uh, goes down here. It's very cool. 
And then the side, we have a little elf saying hooray in tin the window. <laughs> Alright. We'll give. And then here is the little tango gift box. I'm making all the noise. <laughs> and then on here, they have a little window that have gifts and zebra. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Oh, funny thing, this this little guy here is really limbo. Look at that. He's a limbo. <laughs> this guy's limbo too. Very interesting. All the elves. A limbo. That's pretty cool. All right, and then the tower here. You see, it says "Elf Make Toys," and then in the ceiling, right? I believe this is gonna be a light too. That's gonna be a light. This piece right here, and I think these guys, the gears will move too. I'm a, I can't wait to show you guys this in animated. And the reindeer right there, not reindeer, but a deer or a small giraffe. This is the back of the workshop. Here's the <laughs> the power. So this one does take adapter as well, but it did not came with the adapter. Eh, I'm gonna plan I was planning to use the battery anyways, so it's okay. Again, this is the on and off switch. I, I don't know why it's sticking out like this. It's kind of ridiculous. <laughs> okay. So I be I believe this one takes battery. Uh, let's see where the battery is located. Hmm. Interesting. So I don't know where to put the battery in. <laughs> oh, I forgot about this part. This part is cool. This the toys goes up and down here. Goes up to the little factory. All right. Well, let's. Let's figure out where the battery goes. So after reading the instruction menu, I don't think this unit is battery operated. But hey, look, guess what I found in the back? It's the adapter that goes with it. That's so cool. Okay, well, we have some strings attached, and let's see if it works. Okay, so I have the adapter plugged in over there to power and. Also plug in here in the back. All right. I'm very excited to see this in the dark with all the lights on. So let me turn the lights off first. Okay. Yeah, put this off. Oh. Okay. Right now we are in the dark mode. <laughs> let me turn the the lights on. Woo! Well, look at that! Isn't that nice? Let's take a closer look. See the lights here. It works pretty well. The lights here. The toys keep going in here. How does that work? You can see the toy goes in here. And then to here. Isn't that amazing? The spiral goes down. Okay. And then you can see the gear over here. Right. The gifts goes around.
looks nice. But the only part is that on the right side, the lights are not super apparent. <laughs> it's kind of dark in the right side. I'll say the, the bottom of the right side is kind of dark. The top is okay. Yeah? Okay, so this one also goes with music. So I'm gonna turn the music on. You can just, this is a switch and it's also a volume control. So I just turned the lights on. And you can just uh, mess with this to turn the music on as well. Okay, ready? <laughs> I never heard this song before. My overall it looks pretty good. I really love the anime part of this, so the, the turning toys right here. Toys goes up here. And the spirals down here. Okay, we've heard enough of that. So overall, this workshop is a really nice one to have. I can I can put it with my other toys as well. This I have my Christmas tower right here, right? It fits in with all the elfy stuff, like the Christmas Wonderland. Or, yeah, it looks good. The only thing is that it has adapter. It has to have a uh, use adapter instead of battery operated, so that's that's my only concern. And the power switch, why why did they make it have a dangle right here? That's the one, only one thing I don't understand. But overall, it's pretty good. All right, that sums up my review for the day. Let me know what you guys think.